out. We have never had a ring like this before. And if you, oh my goodness, I know. We've never in all the years really had an all diamond ring. And this is an Asher cut yellow diamond surrounded by more diamonds and more diamonds. It's um, over 63 points of gorgeous diamonds. And we are looking at something that is so rare and beautiful. Our QVC price is $4,936. You are about $1,000 off on sale for something new. And Peyton, I always know when you're so excited and I knew it was the opal and I knew it was the garnet, but I have to say the one that you kept bringing us back to was this one when we were chatting earlier today. You know, I'm so I'm so excited about this ring, Jane. You know, diamonds, first of all, I was a diamond dealer. You know, before even I got into colored stones, I was into diamonds. So I've always been a great admirer of diamonds. And that's why I went to the Gemological Institute of America. But when I saw this parcel of Asher cut, fancy yellow, not just yellow, but fancy yellow diamonds, completely natural, no treatment at wow. all. The certificate says fancy yellow. So what's That's the really difference, important. Peyton? Like, what's the difference between a yellow diamond <laughs> and then a fancy yellow diamond? It, the, it's a, the amount of, of intensity of the color. So when you're looking at the color, when you say fancy yellow, it takes it to that next step, especially when you're talking about natural diamonds like this. And Jane, the center, let's talk about the center stone first. Okay. This was mined in Namibia, which is a, a wonderful country. The, the, they control the diamond mines there, they actually do the flow all the way through from when it's picked up from the ground till it's cut until it's sold. So you know exactly where the mine goes. You know exactly where the diamond went. You know exactly where the money from the diamond went. It went to the miners and it went to the people of the country. Mm -hmm. But then what did they do? They sent the rough to Belgium, which is the finest cutting facility in the world. So this stone was not only mined in Namibia, Namibia, but then it was sent to Belgium to be mined. And when you're talking about an Asher cut, you're talking about a cut that some of the most famous diamonds in the world were cut into this cut because it shows the beauty of the stone. It shows the beauty of the color, the richness of the color. But it's like they say it's like looking into a hall of mirrors. When you're looking into it, you see just reflection after reflection after reflection, more and more brilliance. It's one of the most brilliant cuts there is. And by the way, did I mention that it's a minimum VS2 quality? Wow. On the GIA scale. Very, very clean, very, very fine. And then, by the way, it's encircled by more fancy yellow diamonds on the outside of that, a halo. Then we did a little bit of white, and then we did yellow down the side. We wanted to do a ring that really warrants number one, that center stone. But really, you know, whether you're going to wear this, you know what? I've been wanting a special engagement ring. Yeah. I wanted something that's really rare and really special. This could be it. Or you know what? Just as a right-hand ring as, you know what? I deserve it. Mm -hmm. You know, <laughs> I've been waiting for that special something. And when I, when you can say, you know what? My diamond was, was, was mined in one of the finest mines in the world. It was cut by the finest cutters in the world in Belgium. And here it is now, an Asher cut. You know, look at the Imperial wow. Jewels in, in England and look at the Asher cuts that are there. Well, Peyton, we are needing to wrap it up early. Katja, I hope you have your phone.